to show you guys how I make this sweetie dress in my apartment in two days, okay? So I zoomed into the dress and I saw that she has little circle things that was connecting the dress together. And I'm like, where have I seen that before? Like, I've definitely seen that before. And then I remembered when I did a video for my friend when he turned a Gucci dress bag into a shirt and he used the same tool to connect the shirt together. And I'm like, oh, so something I could buy, like I could get that. So I looked it up, it's called an eyelet puncher, I believe that's the correct name. So I ordered an eyelet puncher and then I ordered the keychains to connect the dress. Another thing for this dress is when I was looking at Sweetie's dress, her pictures, her Polaroids are square and I own a Polaroid, but my pictures come out rectangle, right? So I'm like, absolutely not. I cannot use my Polaroids because with me remaking this dress, it has to be kind of, I want it to look like identical. It would make a huge difference if the dress had rectangle pictures. So I'm like, okay, can't use that. Because I didn't have a square Polaroid, I'm like, okay, well, should I buy one? So I looked online on Amazon. They were like $100. So I'm like, mm, that might be a waste of money. So what I did was I had Jasmine come over to my house. And I took pictures of her on my plain wall with the flash on. And then I edited the pictures to make it look like it was taken by a Polaroid. So I added more orange to it. And then I put the pictures in Canva. And I made it look like an actual Polaroid. Because my intent was to go to Staples and print them out on glossy paper which is what I did so this is an example of one of the Polaroids that I take that I took so in Canva I just put it in and I just made space to make it look like it was a Polaroid now because I was cutting these by hand I used the slicer at Staples but these are freehand cuts they're not perfect so that's probably the only like dilemma here is that they're not perfect squares but I did try my best to make sure it was a perfect square and make sure they were all identical so I did try my best on that but that is how I made this dress so these are not real Polaroids these are digital pictures that I made look like Polaroids and these pictures are printed on glossy paper this paper is really thick like this is not regular flimsy paper this is actually like kind of hard to rip I'm just doing what it gotta do like I'll make sure the job gets done like, I really didn't need to buy a whole new Polaroid, so I just made it work. And on camera, it's gonna look popping. So I'm just waiting for Jasmine to come. She's gonna come at 2, it's like 12 o'clock right now. And then we're gonna get this popping. I'm gonna up the backdrop, and we're going to do this shoot. But also, another thing I realized is if you look at Sweetie's dress and Giselle's, they have five pictures going down. And so do I. I have five pictures going down. But I'm thinking that my pictures are a little bit big, so my dress might be a little bit longer than Sweetie's and Giselle's. So if it is too long, I might take off the last row and just have her wear four pictures going down. But it depends. So I don't know. I don't know. But we have to see when she gets here. Girl, let me see it on you. Like, wrap it around you. <laughs> I have to see how it looks on you. How are we gonna like? So I'm thinking to put a string and just string it around you. Oh yeah, from the back. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's not okay. too bad. Is he? Okay. Do you think that we should um? How do you feel? You think it's a little bit too long? Cause it's gonna be like right, right here. It's gonna start like right. Oh, let me see. Cause I could take off one ring at the bottom. Wait, how does that? I could take off one ring. Yeah. Probably just one. How does that feel? It's, it's cuter. It's yeah. sexier. Yeah, you know? and then the bottom's gonna be a little bit tighter because of the string. Yeah, so. mm-hmm. It's okay. gonna be like stitched in. Okay, hey. bomb. Okay, I'm 